that's a major concern that that kind of person would be hired in the school system. Revelations about a local teacher simply stomach turning tonight. Three elementary students trusted of inappropriately touching them. If those allegations are true, they reveal a sickening crime at Key Elementary. Two Works For You reporter Ashley Holt has been working to uncover new information on this story all day for us. She is live outside of the school right now. And Ashley, parents have been getting notified about this allegation, I understand. That's right, Sharon Bryan. This past week, Key Elementary School students got this letter in the mail from the Tulsa Public School District telling them their kids are safe at school. Now, what it didn't, what it didn't share was why they needed that reminder. That's what happened? Tulsa police say last week, Corporal Mark Kraft received three disturbing reports. The parents of three female students accusing a second grade teacher of touching them inappropriately. The police nor the district have released his name. That's a major concern that that kind of person would be hired in a school system. Tulsa Public Schools told Two Works For You in a statement, we do have protocols to prioritize student safety. All personnel matters are confidential, but we want our parents and community members to know the safety of our students rises above anything else. Police tell us it happened in a classroom with other students around. They say the victims are between the ages of 7 and 10. And while we didn't go into the details of what exactly happened, it was enough for those parents to file police reports. I think it's very disturbing that individuals who choose to work with children choose to harm them. When we find out that someone has hurt a child in whatever venue that that is, we want that person removed and the child to get the help that they need to recover. The Tulsa Council of PTA said it couldn't speak on the matter, but its local units work to make certain school is a safe place for each student. Police say the school district has its own administrative investigation separate from theirs. The district says during investigations of parent concerns with staff, that staff member can be put on administrative leave until the conclusion of the investigation. As parents, we want to protect our children the, the best that we can. And when we have entrusted them to someone, on a daily basis when they are often with them more than they are with us and they take advantage of that trust, there needs to be justice and it needs to be served quickly. Corporal Kraft tells me he plans to have this case on the DA's desk by the end of today. Now, as for those students, he did interview all three of them this past week. He wouldn't tell me what exactly they talked about, but coming up in the next half hour, he does tell me what charges this teacher may face if the district attorney does decide to file charges against him. Reporting live out of South Tulsa, Ashley Holt, Two Works For You.